Boom, boom. This is everybody. Welcome back to the channel. All right, so we got a little bit of Soul Landry loaded up today. So we have uh, a couple of things returning. Uh, we've got the BB uh, BB Dong event is up. We'll do some pulls on her a little bit later. Um, first event up is we got the Soul Land Secret Realm. You remember uh, they had this, uh, I think it was like a month ago or whatnot. And I said that the next time that they had it, that it would probably be, be a little bit less stellar, and it is that. Uh, they've taken a lot of the actual really uh, cool items uh, out of the gift shop, and they didn't. Uh, they actually uh, did a really good job uh, by actually increasing it. So we've still got these in here. This is a good way to get uh, um, some of the 100 keys. They've got the, all the SPs. So they did not do anything to this shop this time they will be most likely doing it uh, uh like on the soul forge the first three or four times they had it they had really excellent items uh and then they still have good items but just don't have quite as many uh, as good items but uh they've done uh an excellent job here so this again uh the gold uh, coin shop has just got all the good stuff in it um i would focus uh, on things that are difficult to get uh, you know, uh, the the uh, Dusk Gold Tear Claws, these are very difficult to get. I wouldn't focus on any of the actual um, Soul Masters simply because of the fact that you can get these inside of the Soul Forge. Okay, so there's, and, and they've been consistent with that. So I really don't see wasting the, the money uh, or your coins in this particular uh, thing. So same with the SP Shards, uh, Hidden Weapon Shards. I mean, yeah, you can get a lot, but... This stuff right here is exceedingly difficult to get. Uh, this is not. Um, the Breaking Stones, uh, you can get those each each time that you, they reset the um, salt. You can get that. So uh, the the for me, the, the best choice is going to be um, the rings or the soul bones or the actual um, Duskog Terror Claws. Uh, rebound, of course, you might want to get some SSS. So, but they've got so much really good stuff in here. I mean, all this is good stuff. <laughs> Even the end stuff, which is Spider Soul Core, I mean, is just excellent. Uh, the Silver Coin Shop, uh, it's got some stuff in it as well, too. There's some pretty good stuff in here, especially if you're a newer player. Um, some of this stuff might be useful to you. Um, I know that uh, if you're a newer player, these the, the Dragon's Cores are good because these are excellent for working on your... Um, uh, extended. So, so this is stuff that you can really level up your character with as well as the element stones. Okay. Um, so yeah, it's, yeah, the, they kept, they kept it just exactly uh, where it's at. Um, so definitely want to uh, participate in this, of course. And this is really easy. What I like about this event is it's so easy. It's just stamina. The quests are simple. Use the stamina. Okay. Um, the tokens here, of course, yeah, you're going to have to pay if you want to do these, um, which just would allow you to get a bunch uh, of stuff. Uh, but this is all, you know, because you, you have to use the unlimited, or I'm sorry, the untimed exploration tokens. Uh, those are only available uh, via the actual um, gift shop, okay? Um, untimed means they don't have the actual... Uh, you see this little emblem to here that says three. Um, this right, they ha they don't have that. That's why these are untimed. Uh, this one is untimed. Uh, this one is timed, so limited time, as they say. So, but to get the untimed tokens, you have to purchase those. Okay, so you're not, you know, yeah, unless they give some of those, uh, some of those for free uh, inside of the actual, uh, you know, maybe in the mail or something. Um, they might give us, you know, something like that. So as you can see, you know, it's really, it's really easy to get um, uh, the coins. Uh, so hopefully you'll be able to clear it up. Uh, and once you'll be able to clear it, then you'll be able to get. So you can see I've already got 20 of these coins and 370 of the, of the uh, secret ones. So and, and this is just the first day. Um, I haven't been able to clear any of the other ones yet. So I'll complete that. Uh, but yeah, it's got a really good shop. So that's definitely what you want to focus on. Uh, okay, to clear those, clear as many of those as you can. Um Time limited, there's really uh, nothing new in this, just standard stuff that's in here, the standard check-ins uh, and whatnot. Uh, so there's nothing new from uh, from that front. And then the other is the BB Dong uh, drawing. So I'll go ahead and do the drawings for BB Dong because I've already got the actual. I did a bunch of the Royal Hunting Ground to get 
the tokens. So I do have the actual um, summon. So we'll go ahead and summon for her. Okay, so I have 104, but you automatically get 10 from the um, exchange shop. So I have 114. Uh, so basically, I'm going to need to get um, uh, some pretty high ups. Uh, so 114. So you know that's 40. So you know it, it it's going to require some luck. You know, if I get lucky, hooray. If I don't, you know, then uh, I'll just get it the next up. Okay, see, didn't get very lucky there. So uh, I've got 124 now. I got the 10. That makes me 114 plus the 10 to get in the shop. So I'm going to need I'm going to need a really good one here. Uh, came up short, eight short. I'm going to have 142. Um, so this was pretty good, but it didn't get any of the high ones. Okay, uh, so I have 132. Uh, I'll purchase the 10 from the shop. It's going to give me 142. So I'm going to be eight short. That's that's you know that that's not bad. Okay. Um, you know, I was hoping to get her, but you know, I'm still in the process of building up the actual, um, the actual materials for her, so it's not it's not critical. So this is where you get the ten. You just do the exchange. Mac, you get ten shards. Uh, and this is a chest, um, and she is in the chest. Um, BB Dong, right there. So that's the ten shards that I get from her, uh, and uh, I tapped on with the 132 that I've got, uh, and um, that'll be it. So not not too bad, you know. I was hoping to get her, but yeah, uh, it is what it is. Uh, so basically, that's everything that's going on at this particular time. Um, that should be the last BB Dong, I believe. So the next we should be starting to see some of the newer characters. So we'll have to see. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what they're going to be doing at this particular point. How they're going to look. Uh, I've I've heard that one of, one of the first SSPs is Ayin. Um, we have yeah, she was originally I think an SS. Uh, as someone mentioned the things, but uh, I think she's going to be an SSP, which is the next generation coming out. They're going to be uh, a, a second copy of her. Uh, she was a primo healer, believe me. She's, she was the best healer. When you're early, she's the best healer in the game. Um, but, uh, you know, she's of course surpassed by the triple S's. You got your Oscars on your Linglings out there. Um, and then, of course, uh, the SPs. Uh, so now we're going to be seeing SSP healers. So we'll have to see what they bring to the actual uh, table in terms of uh, effectiveness. I assume it'll be uh, exceedingly useful, <laughs> especially if you're doing something within PvP. Uh, that'll be very useful. All right, so that's all I got. So BB Dong's up. Uh, like I said, there's nothing really else going on. Battle Pass has been reset, so that's starting over. Uh, everything's starting from scratch. Okay, so I wish everybody a happy New Year because today is New Year's Day, of course. Um, and uh, we'll check in again here in a few days once they've uh, uh, posted up the new items. Uh, and we should be having some, you know, Lunar New Year events and stuff like that coming up pretty soon as well. So we'll have to wait and see what happens with that. Okay, uh, so just wanted to do a quick video, let everybody know what's going on. Uh, and that is up, so get in there for her. If you're looking for her, like, go for her. She's supposed to be the best, uh, the best of the SPs out there, BB Dong, uh, and you can tell just by the fact that she got uh, a lot of damage really quick, uh, and it's pretty consistent damage as well too. So she's definitely a damage dealer. Also, you should see your damage increase uh, immensely once you apply her to your team, uh, and hopefully we can get a little bit more targeted damage. Uh, uh, and she does have some AOE capability as well if you're looking for that as well. But, uh, you know, she's always, is always releasing the spiders is, uh, is her thing. So she's going to be doing that as well. But it looks like uh, it happens pretty fast and it does a lot of damage pretty quick. So uh, I guess that's why they're categorizing her as the best. They say she's the best and then Wu's the second best. Um, so, you know, take that for what it is. But uh, uh, go ahead and work on that. And, of course, definitely participate in the, uh, uh, the uh, Soul, Re uh, Soul Land Secret Realm event. You know, get it while the getting's hot. I would assume we'll probably see this once more. Uh, the Soul Land Secret Realm with a really, 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 really good shop. Uh, after that, they'll probably... It'll be reduced a little bit. Um, hopefully, they'll still have the SP Soul Bones in there and the Dust Gold terrors, Terror Claws in there. Uh, but, uh, yeah, um, but I, I don't think we'll see the numbers. That's what happened in the Soul Forge. They're still, they're still there sometimes. Well, we haven't seen the Triple S herbs there, but we have seen the other stuff, but it's in sort of a little bit lower number. Um, the, the, like you see, yeah, I mean, this is just you know, a huge amount. I mean, I've almost actually almost able to uh, 
uh, put five stars on my uh, Terra God set for uh, I got it on Tang Sin at this particular at this particular point. Uh, so yeah, but as you can see, I've got four stars on that <laughs> uh, and four on this one. I'm working on the fifth one right now. Um, so you can really level those things up pretty fast. Um, you know, getting a hundred or two hundred of them. Uh, fortunately, it's uh, it's not that uh, difficult. They don't the the, the uh, requirements to upgrade them aren't that. Uh, aren't that uh, high I think it's only like 16 uh, or something uh, once you get up to that high so it's you know and that that's uh, enables you to to up through it pretty quick um, so that's definitely something useful to get on that and then I'm going to start doing my SPs I start putting some stars on them as well too go to get them up um, you know it's more power more BP uh, it's got my BP up to 294 uh, so yeah we'll see what happens um, uh, on that in terms of whenever we can get BB Dong, but I've, like I say, I'm still working on the mats, so getting her wasn't that important uh, at this particular time. Uh, it takes a lot of mats to get those up to, uh, to get the materials up to level up her, her, her armor and whatnot, uh, but I'll have enough, uh, I'll be able to get her skills up uh, pretty fast. I've got uh, some soul rings saved up, plus I'm going to be getting some more soul rings inside of this soul land, uh, this uh, secret realm event. Um, uh, that should be one of your priorities is those simply because of the fact that they're really difficult to get those because you can only get, really get them consistently in the higher land of the Royal Hunting Ground uh, and you have to have like a super powerful team to do that um, to get into those upper levels where it's useful to actually do it. So getting them inside of this event is an easy way to do it. Um, that's the only other place I've seen them. They took them out of the God Shop. They're no longer there so you can't get them there. So uh, this is the first place I've been able to see them. So you want to snatch them up uh you know just as quick as you can because uh, they'll be useful so that's the use you know that's what you need for the sp character skills assume it's what you're going to need for the ssp character skills as well too so having some in uh in, in your bag uh, would be very useful uh uh for your ssps as well most likely we'll have to wait and see what it is but i, I doubt very seriously if they'll change that uh, i got a feeling the ssps are going to be pretty much like the sps we'll see a divine realm uh and we'll have a pool for the character uh, once you get the character, skills will be leveled up using the 100k soul rings. Um, and as you fuse them, they become stronger and you can level up the skill. Uh, I assume that's what it's going to be. Uh, we'll see. Uh, but we'll have to wait and uh, test that out when it happens. All right. So, um, as always, thanks a lot for watching. Remember to subscribe. Subscribing to the channel it doesn't cost you anything. The only, the only thing a subscription does is get you notified each time I drop a video. This is Kendra coming at you from the corner, signing out.